What we have for lunch? One of the biggest problems here at Enkans is deciding what to have for lunch. So if there's any chefs uh, that are available out there that want a part-time job, or somebody that delivers lunch around Bradford, please get in contact with us. Something, a different selection every day, of course. Healthy meal, of course, has to be a healthy meal. But before that, we've got uh, Hamza and Husnain here to collect their dad's car. It's a Mercedes-Benz E-Class, something a little bit unusual that we don't normally customize here, but we do customize any car. The both of you to collect the car right now. So let's do the reveal with the two young lads. And it's such a nice gesture that they've customized this car for their dad. They've worked extremely hard and they've paid for this out of their own pocket, by the way, believe it or not. What a better way to surprise that dad by customizing his car. We've done a great conversion on this and done a color change. So let's waste no time and do a quick reveal. So, uh, where's your dad? Uh, yeah. Have you locked him in his bedroom? Yeah. yeah. You, yeah. Didn't, you didn't want to show him the car, did you? Yeah, yeah I just want to surprise him later. Are you ready for this? Because we've done a big transformation on this car. Now, you wanted something unique, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready for this. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Are you old enough to drive both of you? Yeah, yeah. How old are you? 17. 17? What about you? 19. 19? Yeah. Have you got your driving license? Not yet, no. What about you? No. The first thing that I did when I turned 17, I got my driving license. I started, I started to learn how to drive when I was 16, a provisional license. Oh, okay, as soon as I turned 17, I went for my test. Come on guys, you gotta, you gotta catch up. Yeah, you yeah, wanna yeah. be driving this car. Yeah, definitely. Okay, come on, let's do the reveal. So here's the car, guys. What do you think? Oh, yeah! Oh my God. It is the same car. Yeah. What do you think of the colour? Will you stop cleaning it up? And the main thing of this car is the colour. We painted it Nardo Grey. You guys said we want a very unique and beautiful yeah, colour. Yeah. Something that really stands out. We all decided on Nardo Grey. But anyway, it's been a great transformation. So, what do you think? I can't wait for my dad to see this car. I'm gonna be. To be honest. Do you think it's the best Mercedes you've ever driven? Have I done a good job? Yeah. Now is the one. Marks out of 10, guys. Come on. Marks out of 10. 10. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Job done. You guys enjoy the car. Here's the keys. You haven't got a license, have you? So no, you can't no. drive it. Call your dad. Tell him to pick the car up. Yeah, Alright guys, take care. Another car on the road to the Bradford. Quick reveal for you on a not a car, but a van. Yes, my friend Sean from Wheels Taxis bought a damaged Ford Transit van and he wanted it repairing. So he bought the van to me and asked him, what are you gonna do with the van? Well, he said, I'm gonna take my son motorbike and he put all the motorbikes in there and take him on the mud trucks. So we've repaired it all, but not only that, during the repair, we've customized the van, we've changed the color, we've put a body kit on it and put some alloy wheels on it, especially for his son. Now his son doesn't know we've done all the customization. So he's here right now to collect the car, thinking that we've just repaired it. So now we're gonna do the reveal, show him the van all transformed. This is something that you guys do not want to miss. Let's go do the reveal. Louis, from Wheels. Louis, you're not, uh, you're not from the boy band, is that? No, no. How then, mate, how you doing? I'm all right, look, thank you. Hey, you're getting better and better by day, you aren't you? Yeah, so where, have you where have you been? Been out of the You've just been a shimbler, that's where you've been. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, this van that Sean bought, oh my God. It was a mess. Mate. See all these white hairs? They were black when you dropped the van off, didn't they? You yeah. remember, don't you? Yeah. You just said to me, where did all these white hairs come from? Well, no, said, oh, that van, that thing that Sean bought. Well, what have you bought it for? What are you going to do with it? 
I don't know, I think we're going to let him go. Well, you're going to drive it around. Yeah. No, not for a drive, it's got a motorcycle. What is it? Motor? Motocross. Motocross. So is it a wood truck? Yeah. yeah. Is that what you do? Yeah. That's what it's bought it for. So what, you can take it professional or what? You just, is it just a hobby? Hobby. Hobby? Yeah. But anyway, it's nerdy. If we've done a little repair on it. Bit of body work, not the best, but we just try to put something together for you. <coughs> Do you know what I mean? And uh, I'll put a little sticker on. But it's repaired anyway, it's all done. It's just in there getting bolted. Oh, you know, have a look at it. Yeah. Yeah, let's go, brother. Come on, mate, let's go. Let's go, pal. Let's go, pal. <laughs> Come on, then. Never caught me for a shimmer, did you? So, your dad's doing you a little surprise. You probably don't know that idea. I painted it pink. I'm joking. <laughs> I'll fix it all up for you. But let me know what you think of the repair job, yeah? Wow. What do you think, brother? That looks bad, boy. Thank you, though. Wow. That is sick. What do you think? Yeah, that's bad. Do I deserve a shimless for this or what? Yeah, definitely. What do you think, Louis? That's bad, boy. <laughs> what do you think then? Max out of 10 then. Tell your dad. Thanks your dad, mate. He's shocked. He's speechless, mate. <laughs> Thanks to you, Sean, mate. I told him, make sure you listen to your dad now. Make sure you work hard because your dad went all out on this, man. And he said, I know. Yeah. He loves it. So Shazam's kids were loving their dad's new customised car. Obviously a great gesture for them to spend some of their own personal money and get their dad's car customised in a beautiful Nardo grey colour. And Louis, wow, off the camera, honestly, he was bouncing. What his dad did for him for the van that he takes his bikes in, he absolutely loved it. He was shocked, he actually came in here thinking we're just doing a little repair, but we fully customised and transformed his van and he was over the moon. So on that note, let's continue with Nardo grey paint. I customised a Range Rover Sport a while ago now. Now when this footage comes on, please don't laugh, don't take no screenshots and send me photos of myself because my beard is long, my hair is all scuffy as well and I look quite run down but it's because I didn't go for a haircut. My hairdresser was poorly for a few weeks so I just let my beard and hair go long. So please guys, avoid looking at me, just focus on the car. So this was a Range Rover Sport. It was a conversion that I did with a facelift conversion 2014 to 2020. Full wide arch kit, amazing body kit for a friend in Scotland. Check this out. So here you have it guys, the 2015 Range Rover Sport Aero body kit. This is the wide arch edition that we did a couple of years ago. And uh, the customer came back and he wanted the same body kit, but he wanted the headlights to be facelifted. Now what that means is making the car look like a new model. So this was originally a 2015 model and uh, we've changed the headlights so it looks like the 2020 model Range Rover Sport. And that's the only difference that is on these Range Rover Sports. So if you're gonna facelift your Range Rover Sport, the 2014 to 2017 model, to make it look like a 2018 to 2021 model, we can do that here at Encarn. We've kept the specific body kit, the Baradzai Aero body kit, the wide arch one. So we painted it all narrow grey. The only problem that we had was that this bumper that we had originally was only to fit the 2014 to 2017 models. So what we had to do was we had to cut this bumper, make it a little bit longer so it can accommodate for the new facelift headlights. Uh, we put the new wings on with the new SPR side vents and obviously we've made the wider arches to fit the new 2019 wings. So 2019, 20 uh, rear facelift lights, we've got the aero back bumper with the uh, additional diffuser and with the carbon fiber barrage side exhaust so yeah this has been a big conversion but it's facelifted so if you guys want to facelift make sure you visit NCAN. You know what? I held that footage for such a long time and Zach 
He said, you gotta put it on. I said, no, you're not putting that footage on. I look horrendous. So anyway, I'm loud and proud. Nothing to be shy of. It's not what you look like on the outside, it's how you are from the inside. That's important. But anyway, hope you like that car. Now we'll get another crazy Nardo Grey Range Rover that I customized, a Range Rover Volk Bison. That was a monster. And the video shoot was just as great. We painted it Nardo Grey, it was the perfect color for that car. Check it out. So there you go guys, that's all our Nardo grey cars that we've done. We've done many, many more. It's one of our most popular colours that we paint here. And it's a safe colour as well. I mean, it's very difficult to choose colours. A lot of customers come to me and say, help me choose a colour and they leave it to me. And it is quite stressful because you can get a colour wrong on a car. And it's a very expensive mistake. So Nardo grey is a safe option. I mean, Lamborghini use it, Ferrari use it, all the supercars, yeah, all the supercar manufacturers use Nardo grey. And uh, well, I use it on all my conversions as well, and I do offer it to the customer. So, if you do want your car customizing and painting in Nardo Grey, give me a call and I'll get it done. Anyway, thank you for watching, guys, and uh, I'll see you on the next vlog. Stay safe, stay humble, and I'll see you next week.